And also, since I have access to Copilot, right, you can even log in with Copilot and now you're not paying for something else. You're using your Copilot subscription for that. So I really like open code. I've set up MCP servers. I've used agents. It also has the same planning and building modes. Um, you can create your own agents. You can really wire it up to do it, it. Like it is basically Claude code in many ways. So I love open code. I think it's fantastic for me. It is the first one that has pulled me away from um, an IDE based AI. Yeah. Flow. Nice. Yeah. The bring your own key. A lot, of, a lot of these editors will allow you to bring your own key. And that's awesome. Um, if you're not spending a whole bunch some of these plans make a lot of sense because you're you're probably spending more than than it, than it's costing them and you're just burning some vcs money but i think the future uh, hopefully will be bring your own key uh where you can just pay for your own usage and not have to get nickel and dimed for i don't know 14 bucks a month per user you know Right, yeah. exactly. Yeah. And I haven't used open code, but I'm I'm tempted because of those exact reasons. But that's why I've stuck with cloud code because I was already paying for the anthropic cloud plan. Like I can use cloud desktop, I can use cloud code. Mm -hmm. But it is nice that you could bring whatever key you want. One yeah. one thing I'll mention that I got I I did set up with cloud code and I'm sure you could do a similar thing with open code is I wanted to be able to just vibe from the couch or from my bed. So actually in just in my house I set it up so that I could SSH into one of my machines that's running cloud code. And then I could literally SSH from my Android phone to just keep nah. prompting, prompting it. <laughs> and I'm sure you, uh. you could do something similar with open code where like it, it now it's just, because it's terminal based, yeah, you can just yeah. do things remotely. You just SSH in and you can start prompting it. So that's one of the other cool things about these CLI based tools.